All right, guys, good morning. Welcome back. This is the latest Ubuntu 24.04 LTS recently released. I recorded this a few days ago, and I thought, I thought about this long and hard. I had mixed feelings. I have mixed feelings about this one. You may recall that the last time I did a install of Ubuntu 22, I had no sound. And uh, I did the upgrade first, tried to fix it, didn't work. Well, let me do a fresh install, still no sound. Went into the sound settings like what you see here, and it said dummy output. I'm like, who's the comedian here, me or you? That was the final end of Ubuntu for me, I guess. I guess it all started back in 2017. Before that, I thought Ubuntu had reached its peak in 2016 with the Unity desktop. I had that installed on two machines and it ran flawless. Then there was a shock in the Linux world that Ubuntu dropped Unity and went with GNOME, one of my least favorite desktop environments. It never feels complete. It's slow. Extensions always break. Yeah, it's not the best for Windows users, but I stayed with it until, well, until Ubuntu 2022, until I had the dummy output, and I thought to myself, okay, there's no need for insults. <laughs> anyway, that was, that was the end of Ubuntu for me, and I guess, I guess it all comes down, came down to a matter of trust. The thrill is gone. As it were, you know, my, my first date with Ubuntu was back in 2006. So Ubuntu, I guess, will always have a special place in my heart because it was my first journey into Linux. And it's because of Ubuntu that I am here talking to you, meeting all you wonderful people around the world. Not just with Linux, but whatever that you guys use. And it's been a fantastic journey. But there's just nothing left in Ubuntu for me except... Uh, this is exciting, except the immutable version of Ubuntu, which I'm looking forward to that because Chromebooks have been flawless. Of course, they are. Chromebooks are the godfather of immutables, I guess you can say that. They work great. And if Ubuntu can pull that off, the immutable version of Ubuntu to run flawless, then maybe Ubuntu can restore my faith in, well, Ubuntu and no more dummy outputs. So as far as this one goes... Yeah, it looks good. It looks polished. Obviously, a lot of work went into this. For me, it's okay to use, but I just don't trust it anymore, and the thrill is gone. At least for now. I don't know. What do you guys think about all this? It's, um, yeah, I didn't even bother doing a full install on this. I ran it off a of USB. It ran okay, but even with the full installs, when Windows 11 runs faster in a 10-year-old machine than Ubuntu, something's not right. I mean, I'm grateful that Windows 11 is faster, but you would think Linux would be faster. And some Linux is, but not Ubuntu. Anyway, this is my quick look at Ubuntu 24.04, the non-immutable system. I'm looking forward to that one because that one thrills me. This one does not. Catch you on the next one, guys. Take care. Peace.